Now, you might have some sheeple that tell you that when you see the trails coming out of the ends of the wings instead of out of the engines, that they're dumping fuel, okay? Take a look at this. I'm gonna freeze it right here so you can see that this is not coming from the four engines. It's coming out of nozzles on the wings. Now, like I said, you have these sheep that are asleep that will tell you, oh, it's dumping fuel out those nozzles. It's dumping fuel out those nozzles. Well, I'll just say that you're a special kind of a sleep. If you think that that plane is dumping all that fuel out going across that sky, that's what I'm telling you. If you think all that is fuel coming out of that plane, he wouldn't even make it to the airport. You have lost your sheep of mind. And if you do believe that nonsense, then you have to believe that all the planes flying over you all day long are just dumping fuel. All you gotta do is Google it, check it out. Planes dump fuel, also known as fuel jetsoning, infrequently, but it's not an uncommon occurrence. Pilots typically only dump fuel in rare emergency situations when the plane needs to land as soon as possible. Very simple. Planes don't do this every day, all day long. Planes don't dump fuel every day, all day long. Stop listening to these fools. Okay, now if you look right here, that is a chemtrail. Now if you look over right here, you know what that is? That is a contrail. It's really simple. Chemtrail, which will linger in the sky for hours and hours and hours long after the plane is gone. And this one right here will not because it is a contrail. And you'll see another one right up here. Check this out. That is a chemtrail. It lingers and stays in the sky all day. Okay, that's what a chemtrail does. But a contrail conversation trail behind a plane, a regular plane that is not a chemtrail plane, it disappears shortly after the plane goes by, as you can see right here. Chemtrail, contrail. Big difference, people. Big difference.